Hey gang, FLX Beer Reviews, back again for another episode of As Beer Swirls, live edition. Sure, uh -huh. sure, what uh, yeah, so on location. Yeah, on location. <laughs> we're at uh, Crafty Owls and Lagers. It's their 11th anniversary. We kind of snuck out back, away from all the bands and food trucks and mayhem, and we got a beer. So, uh, Mike, what are we uh, drinking? Uh, we have got a blueberry wheat beer. Uh, what's the ABV? I think it's five... Point six. Yes. We didn't do any research before no. we came out here. It was flying. Like, fly let's go get beers. Beer. Walk back and review it. Like we need content. Is. Allegedly, no. a little birdie told me we're out of content. So <laughs> that's what we're doing. So yeah, it looks great. Very nice uh, amber kind of color. I don't know how the color's coming through on there, but uh, let's get a whiff on we'll this. We'll find thing. out. Yeah. So you kind of get that kind of uh, obviously wheat presence, but there's this sweet kind of grainy kind of thing going on with it, right? Uh, Hayfield flaked wheat more than I'm going to take your word for it. This thing is all like fresh blueberry mixed with blueberry bubblelicious gum. Yeah, but listen, I was getting there. I just didn't want to, you know, go with the obvious right off the bat. All right. Blueberry. Fresh blueberry, right? <laughs> Want to yeah, set? yeah, I do because we got fresh vintage yeah. playing in the background here. So it's, it's like ice cold so. uh, off tap. So yeah, yeah. Oh wow! So the blueberry on first set, it wants to be subtle, but it's really not. It kind of just overwhelms the beer to a point, and then the back of the palate—that's where you get that heavy weediness and. Um, you almost there's a bit of a like drying citrus kind of finish yep. to it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I agree with everything you said. It's very it's very blueberry forward, fresh blueberry forward with that bubble uh, bubbleicious gum, and then it turns into like a wheat crackery um, kind of grassy uh, dry finish on the back. Um, it's very light and airy. Uh, yeah, carbonated. It, it's just kind of dancing around. It's a great summertime. Beer. I really appreciate the fact that the blueberry, it isn't like, it's not artificial, right? It's not like they just went to the store and bought some blueberry extract and- Don just... wouldn't have that. Oh, Don would not have that. Well, lots of fresh blueberries in this beer. I'm sure you had something to do with but it. But that nice fresh blueberry adds this uh, tartness to it. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. that sour tart that you get when you pop the blueberry. Like, I think you're tasting all of the blueberry, like the, the skin, the flesh inside, and it tastes like you just popped open the, the yeah. plastic container. The big fat blueberries. I'll tell you what though, it's it's so drying. Oh, it's I'm just dry. like, oh my god! It, well, you have to go back. It makes you go back <laughs> to get more blueberry to like it kind of really punch does. Those. But dude, okay, it's a beautiful 75 degree day. Uh, Perfect weather for this. We got the Mug Club freaking uh, jerseys on. So yeah, we're uh, great time down here at Crafty Owls and Lagers. We'll probably pop out a few more of these. Yeah, we're right? gonna. Well, if we don't get. They might be some fun content. Yeah, we'll see. Stuff. We'll yeah, see. But. All right, gang. Uh, what, oh, what do we rate it? Oh, I'll give this. Uh, I'll give this a four-two all day. I love this. Beer. Okay, this is so good. I'll give it a four. I'll give it a four. I would just like a, a touch more sweetness on the end. Do you think if if that bubblicious bubble gum came out a little more, that would provide a little maybe that confectionery sugar you find on gum? <laughs> see, I, I think the, I think the amount of blueberry is like it's appropriate. I just. I wish the base wheat beer just had a little bit more of this kind of sweet aspect. Okay. The dryness is just a touch too much. Okay. Me. Yeah, yeah. But usually don't do dry very So here's the thing. Maybe we'll do tangerine wheat later because that's my wheat. That's good stuff here. Anyway. Uh, uh, I'll give it a four. Okay. okay. A four. Sounds good. All right. Uh, until next time, link tree on below. Cheers to crafties. Cheers. Thanks for watching.